Episode 8 of the Pacific. <laughs> Let's go. Well, for one thing, I'd like to be out there fighting with Johnny. Instead of making camouflage paint. That's where you're wrong, Carlo. Some guys have to fight. Sure. But some guys have to give us the stuff to fight with. Yeah, sure, sure. Go ahead. Oh, this is just excruciating. I, where is this story going to go? Like, he can't sustain this. Hey, sweetheart, always good, though. I sound like a movie star, right? Everyone else could enjoy his fame, except him. I get free drinks because of my hero brother. How about that? I guess this is just it on the grander scale, isn't it? Everybody benefits, apart from the soldiers themselves. Is this him writing a letter, or maybe his like memoirs? Like, I imagine he has a book. This would be so much better for him. Yes, sir. What would you like me to do until then, Captain? Take it easy. Put your feet up. Whatever you want. Oh, it's so frustrating. They can't give him the one thing that he wants as a reward. Not even as a reward, he just let him do his damn job. Wow. You gotta go faster than that. I, I you guess at least these body. should be like really good soldiers because they're getting, you know, almost one-on-one -on -one treatment that. here. Go and get yourself some more. Uh, yes, Sergeant. Come on, move it. Oh, and he looks even better in person. Oh, and here he comes. You see these stripes? I'm an NCO just like you. I have work to do. <laughs> Look, LA is full of girls for a guy like you. You'll do fine. Happy hunting, Sergeant. Hard to get, hard to get. It's like just even more um, appealing to him because she's not falling at his feet like everybody else is. There's another medal in your future if you can get at the table. How long have you been waiting for? We gave up waiting. It's like this every liberty. Oh, I'll see what I can do. What this is where he can use his fame for good. Oh, for his own benefit. Big Shot here thinks he can get us a table. Oh, it better work. If it doesn't work, I'm gonna die. No. You go. I'm thinking of joining the Navy. Yes, good wing woman. That's why you arranged all this? To impress me before we get down to business? Business? Exploring the bed sheets together? No. Well, that's standard operating procedure for you, isn't it? When you arrived with one of those blonde starlets on your arm. There you went, right to the front of the line. And everyone was saying, Ooh, ah, there goes John Bazalone, the hero of Guadalcanal. Line to get in was so long, I was still there when out you came, a brunette starlet on your arm, and back into the same limousine. And everyone said, ooh, ah, there goes John Bassalone, the hero of Guadalcanal. You ever make it inside? I had a shrimp cocktail and a Coke just before they closed the joint. You didn't do anything a million other guys haven't done. You just did it in a nicer room. Oof. Obviously, like, we know him more. I feel so bad for him. I do understand where she's coming from. It must have been nice to kind of... There'll be an expectation about what you'll do and for who. Um, I'm Lieutenant Sohn. But it's I'll be quite tough on him there. How are the men shaping up? All two of them? <laughs> the men. The company comes in today from Main Side. Both of them. Oof. A lady in overalls. Got any bad loan? Uh, this may not be appropriate. He is relentless. Hold on. Not always a good thing. I feel like he needs to take her to like a average restaurant. Something more intimate. So it's not kind of flashy Barcelona getting us a table. What did you say? Said I want to slap a job, Gunny. <laughs> That's what the enemy is to you, huh? A fucking bug tooth cartoon dreamed up by some asshole on Madison Avenue to sell soap. Well, let me tell you something. 
the Jap I know, the Japanese soldier. He has been at war since you were in fucking diapers! The Japanese soldier doesn't care if he gets hurt or killed. As long as he kills you. Now you can call him whatever you want. But never, ever fail to respect their desire to put you and your buddies into an early grave. Is that clear? Yes, Johnny! Why don't you in your full packs? Gear up! You can't take this too lightly. Like, there's a balance between kind of dark humour and being, um, like, disrespecting the gravity of the situation. Best coffee I ever had was on Guadalcanal. Morning after the battle. I know the story. Not this part. We stole some coffee from the doggies when they came ashore. Liberated some hooch from their officers, too. Oh. Anyway, morning after the battle, my guys cooked up the coffee over a fire of green coconut logs. Wasn't any part of me that didn't hurt. Burns on my hands. Ears still ringing from the shelling. But when they handed me that cup of coffee, I never tasted anything so good. Not that I don't appreciate this. What was the best cup of coffee you ever had? He's so much more attractive in this scene. <laughs> kind of being true and intimate. My parents ordered two cups of coffee, and he put the milk and one sugar in for me. That was the best I ever had. <laughs> it's a very different experience from, you know, his family. Incredible what can happen over a cup of coffee. be looking forward to my freedom. I can't imagine it. I love the Marines. You do too. I love everything about it. No, I can't imagine being anywhere or doing anything else. You might hear this all the time. You're the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. Be the uniform. <laughs> I love them. <laughs> She's like the perfect person for him. Two short bursts, she like, five won't take the kind of fluffy bullshit, but she understands what it means to kind of belong to the Marines and. Ready! Gun love set! It. I couldn't hit the side of a barn with that thing. Better stop practicing. Yeah. Going in. <laughs> oh, my hat. I got it. <sighs> that shot. Look at that. That is beautiful. I feel like I've almost forgotten what show I'm watching because it's going to get grim at some point. Gunnery Sergeant John Bassalone has decided that home can wait. He will be joining us. Carry on, Gunny. Oh, so he's going to go back? Is this a good choice? Because he, like, he was afloat before, but now he has found something that makes him happy, but... Does he need to add to his baggage? They can ship me out whenever they want. So if you're looking for something else, somebody in a different line of work, tell me now. That's quite gentlemanly of him. I'm in for the duration plus six months. I know how it goes, Sergeant. So, where do we go from here? Come <laughs> on. 